Hi everyone, this is going to be our very first read aloud. I'm going to read a book called A Very Special Critter. I loved these Mercer Mayer books when I was a child and I dug them out of storage and brought them to Fred L to read to you all. One thing I loved about these books is there were always little critters kind of hanging out. So you'll have to keep your eye out there's always a cricket and, and sometimes a spider too. All right. One day my teacher said, a new critter is coming to class tomorrow. I was glad. I hoped the new critter would be someone really cool. Then my teacher said, our new student is a very special critter. He can't walk, so he uses a wheelchair. I want you all to try very hard to make him feel at home. I was a little scared because I had never known anyone in a wheelchair before. I told my dad about it. He said, just because he's in a wheelchair doesn't mean he's any different than the rest of you. He probably just needs some special help once in a while. I thought that made sense. The next day, they brought the new student to our class, and he looked scared. You know, I think I'd be scared too if I were a new student. But his wheelchair was really cool. It had stickers of dinosaurs and bunny monsters all over it. My teacher said, this is our new student, Alex. We are very happy to have you in our class. Then we all introduced ourselves. Introduced, that's a pretty big word. Introduced, when you introduce yourself, you might say, hi, my name is Miss Hayes, or hi, my name is Jerry. Whatever your name is, that's an introduction. I was curious about Alex. So was everyone else. At recess, we all talked to Alex. Some critters asked him questions about his wheelchair. He didn't seem to mind. At first, everyone in the class thought Alex needed a lot of help. We were wrong. I want you to look at this picture and try to think why the little critter knew that Alex didn't need that much help. Hmm. He can go almost anywhere he wants in his wheelchair. Once in a while, he needs a little push to get over a bump. His wheelchair can't go upstairs, so he rolls up in the special rampant school. His wheelchair has pouches to carry his books and things he needs for school. Sometimes he even carries my books for me. Sometimes Alex needs help reaching things way up high. Sometimes I do too. Now, I still need help reaching the top shelf in the grocery store. Have you been keeping an eye out for the little critters that are on every page? I see them here. Uh-oh, what do you think is going to happen with that paint? He plays games in the playground with the rest of us. When we play dodgeball, he always gets the most people out. And he's great at volleyball. He does have a little trouble with hide and seek though. Why do we think he might have trouble with hide and seek? We could say because his wheelchair is pretty big so he can't hide behind the little trees. Alex rides a special bus. It has a lift that takes his wheelchair up and down. We all take turns helping him to the bus. Alex likes the same things as my other friends like 
he plays with race cars and dinosaurs and he loves super critter super critter looks like a superhero for our halloween party at school alex dressed up like a car he had the best costume in the whole school that is a pretty awesome costume He's a good artist too. He won an art contest at school and our class got an ice cream party. Mm. What did Alex draw that won him a prize? An ice cream party prize in the art contest. I think it might be the dinosaurs that he drew that won them the ice cream party. Once in a while, something will come up that Alex needs help with. It's, but it's no big deal. Sometimes I need him to help me too. What's the thing that the little critter needed help with? You might get a hint from looking at this picture. Maybe a math problem? Last page. My dad was right about Alex, even though he's a special critter. He's just one of the gang. Oh, look at our class photo. That's a pretty cool picture under the tree. All right. I hope you loved that Mercer Mayer book. Very special critter. Have a great day.